Just listen what's called the years The word of the guy who was hated by the God of failure Just lean SPW, you're still really gambling with your life on the on the whole copyright strike thing. I don't even I don't even know if this character's out yet for Guilty Gear. No, no, I think it's cool. I think he's out. I haven't I don't play Strive, but the music is really good. Uh, as for the GIF, uh, well, I mean we'll see when we get in game. But I was doing myself a bit of grinding off stream, and I got myself plus and mining for the team. I don't know if I can use both of them, but. One day I'll be able to use them, and they're just very cute, and I can like swap between them whenever I feel more plusily or minely. Minely. Thank you, Guilty Gear. Uh, let's freaking get into it. Music. And not music. Face. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, good. I did on mute. This time, I actually made sure to get all the prep done beforehand. Uh, let's. We're going to jump right in, and luckily, Chatot will remind us what was going on. The others, the others have yet to return from Crystal Cave. I understand that they are scouring the place for clues. You two shouldn't waste any time joining them. I have wasted much time joining them. It's been like five days, and every time the rest of the team comes back does the and three smiles go for miles and then leaves for crystal cave uh uh let's go through some of the stuff that i've done i am now level 30 i don't remember what i was at before i'm hoping it was like low 20s that i'm not that far i have gotten other oh the mirror and maxine are the plus one minin i will get to see now if they get to come along with me and Pipla, uh, Quincy, he has... I'm going to turn this down a smidge. There you go. Uh, has this fused thing for defense and special defense. Basically, to save inventory, it looks like. When you get two pieces of the stat cards, like Piplup card and Piplup, like, something else, you can put them together so they save more space in your bag. And I've also been doing a ton of stuff. If you look at the YouTube VODs, uh, there is uh, a video of me finding a secret, the secret bazaar, which someone mentioned in the game, in game, I don't remember who it was, but they're like, rumor has it that each dungeon has a secret bazaar that you can stumble upon. And I went in it and it had a spot where you could heal up. You could get buy a little grab bag that usually has like a gummy or something in it. And uh, Licky Licky will clean all your orbs 
which luckily he has cleanse orbs behind him and he's not using his tongue and uh Shedinja will just bounce you out of the dungeon if you want to if you want an escape which is awesome uh, I can already imagine there will be times where I'm like, I can't do it, dude, but I don't have an escape orb. I just have to keep going, and then I'll find a, I'll find a bazaar and be able to bounce. Uh, and then also, Curlia runs it, which is very cute. I like the Pokemon Curlia. Uh, but we're all ready to go, so let's... Actually, I should go pick up the uh, Plusle and Minun stuff that I have. Because I did pick up a bunch of loot boxes that what's his face Zatu has been cracking open for me. It's good that we have like we have so much inventory space, but it's good that a lot of the stuff seems to be like taking up space, like these uh uh what are they called like the whatever you call these things uh Pokemon specific items. Electabuzz, Voltart. Well, I'm not done yet. I think I already have this one. Yeah. So I can get rid of that Puzzle Tail. Okay. Man, I have a lot of junk in here. And if I have two Minin items, I could put those together. But I would probably require more pieces. No, no, I can do it. I just need money. All right, sorry. I have a little bit more prep I got to do. One of these days, we're just going to get mugged. And having all this money is like me being lazy and just taking all the money out in one big... Like, if, that, if this was an actual bank, they would be like... Uh, flagging the account. Like, why are you subtracting $6,000? So I could do... I don't need to do that, because I don't intend to have a Ninetales on the team. Okay, we actually don't have the option to do this yet. Skip Bloom, Tauros, Vibrava, Combi, Nidorina, Sigma, Sigma Nets. All right, you. I thought as soon as you had the two pieces, Krogunk would always be like, "Man, you want to put those together and make a thing," but no, that does not seem to be the case. Audio seems a bit quiet. Let's turn that up. It's always. I don't know what it is. The Pokemon vods are always more on the quiet side. I'm just glad they can hear me. Like the music's very good, but it's not like knock your socks off, must listen. It's not it's no bomb rush cyberphone. Uh okay, we got the team. We've got uh We got pretty much everything we need. We got two revivies. We got escape orbs. Let's get the hell up going. I'm gonna I'm just gonna go. I'm like, wait. Okay, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I actually haven't looked at what they do, and I because I don't think they have good moves. So let's see if we can teach them Thunder Wave real quick. I, I have, you, I, I have no money. One moment. <laughs> alright, 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 alright. I was so confident in myself. No. Remember. Boost attack and special attack by two members in the room by one level does not affect the user. So the trouble is that I want them to use this, but they're just going to constantly be clapping. And it's going to take up a ton of time. Now, Thunder Wave. Oh, that's some shit. Oh, dude, we could totally make them into... It's actually kind of kind of cool. We don't need Encore. Encore is for nerds. Oh, I've never seen this. Crank it up. <laughs> Electrofire. <laughs> Why are you saying your name? Electrofire. Nice.
Ah, Maxine's gotten a little bit more stuff in. Hold on. Those are all really good. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Now, I could stick their moves together, but... How would this work? So, n at least in the first game, Pokemon uh, uh, Ally AI had a bit of a foible where it would use a buff. It would if if two moves were linked, it would use the combined move even if they just want to use the the whatever, the buff part or the debuff part. But if I lead with quick attack, maybe they would only use it when it's the right time. This, this is for science. This is for science. Yeah, I like that. What is that it? Is that all I had to do? Oh, okay. But we'll just do it for one. Because this only works... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Because this only works... Halves the target's attack. Dope. And then this only works on the person in front. Unless... Unless... Yeah, I like that. All right, that's good shit. Thank you, Electrovire. All right, now we're ready to go. Um, the team is ready. I'm ready. Let's go. So, the reason we're going to Crystal Cave is because this is the suspected third lake where the time where a time gear would be stationed at so this is crystal cave somewhere inside this cave there should be a passageway that leads to zelf's lake but it will take us forever if we search every step of the way for starters let's go as deep as we can let's do our best after yeah that's usually how it goes we usually got to go as deep as we all right do we do we can bring all four that's awesome oh man i'm so excited so, I actually gave neither of them helping hand, which is okay. I think they'll be able to... Well, they're just here for moral support. That's kind of their whole bag. Ow. We could also go for a more grindy fighting style, because we have ways to, like, debuff them. That's fine. Ew. Alright, we're fine. I don't have a... Oh, I do have a heal seed. Too good to use syndrome my ass. <laughs> Poison stinks. Oh, this is all you. Bang. Bang. That's such a lame trap. I, I mean, it's not like, you know, murdering me. It's just annoying. Everyone's a freaking critic. All right. Grab the apple. Go around the trap. That's fine. They're not holding anything. I mean, I guess we might as well also look at this. One shot will just kill someone, right? Yeah. Can't work on bosses because it's an orb, but I'm sure we can find some use for it. Bang, bang. Ah, please stop hitting me with poison type moves. Okay, no, you're going, going all out on this guy. <laughs> I might have one of these two take the hit for me. Speaking of taking the hit, 
Sorry. I love you guys, but that does not mean I'm going to let you guys use my revive seeds. <laughs> ah, delicious. Ooh, that could be useful. Wow, I've gone every single possible direction except for the one I could have started in. We don't gotta deal with him. Yeah. Yeah, get me out of here. So weird seeing like Gen 4 Pokemon in this game. Leveled up, great. That's so cute. Everyone out here getting bit. Besides, this is probably a two parter type dungeon, like one where that's fine. Uh, oh. Dude, they're gonna... I mean, if they had any way to fight back, they'd be fucking him up right now. Oh. Hi. Um, is this gonna cause an issue? Yeah, welcome to the team, uh, Wanda. Are, are you just gonna bounce? Because I'm, I'm kind of full. Yeah, sure. Bye. Sick. Well, that's gonna make adventuring and recruiting new dudes a lot easier. Because now the game won't stop you at four. And that's probably why they let us bring in four. I love it. This game just has more and more quality of life changes. Ah. Ew. And there's our door. And there's my ride. Uh. Uh. This is fine. He attacked. He raised my attack. This is fine. We got there. But I'm still. I still have the attack up, don't I? I can't tell. But I imagine I do. This is a little less effective, but this cuts corners. It doesn't cut corners! Quincy, kick his ass. Oh, never mind, I got him. The other thing with the that I forgot to mention about the Just Lean song, the the one that Johnny's theme and what I played for this, is that it keeps reminding me of a One Republic song. And I just keep like mixing up the words. I like I go Everybody love Wait, no, that's not the that's a different song. Get out of here. Let's go ahead and use this. Oh, uh, Mira, plus, is, plus still has, uh, still has an attack move. Oh, that's a multi-hit move. We don't, we're not about that. Get out of here. Cute box. When did you, what's up with the different colors? That still got me wondering. Yeah, we'll use this. Oh, that's right. These guys are rock types. I can beat them up.
Oh, they're gonna be getting a ton of XP here. Fake tears to drop special defense. That's good, but I don't think that's really what we're here for. But we can get rid of Spark. It's just what I mean. I guess uh, attack down is not always going to be useful, but I think fake tears is going to be less useful a lot of the times too. We might as well just pop that. There's our stairs. You know, it would be nice, and it's not like a huge deal. But it would be really cool if we could set a marching order so that, you know, everyone kind of got in line properly. Like, I would really like it so that it was Turtwig, either either Plusle or Minon, then Quincy, and then the fourth one. Oh, that's so good. Excellent. Uh, this way? This way. Nope. What's the food situation? We got apples. We have two apples. I mean, might as well use this now. Oh, they changed the sound effect on that. All right. defense up. It's down here? It is down here. I don't know if I finished talking about it, but I think this is a two-parter dungeon. Like, there's gonna be a midpoint where I can, like, get all my stuff back and save. So, I'm not too beat up about it if I lose all my, if I use up all my moves. Rocks. Alright. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm fixing it. Don't know if I'm gonna have. Uh, no, I should be fine. If the, if there is the checkpoint. Uh oh, I don't like the look of that. Oh no, it's right there. We're fine. Is this the deepest part of the caverns? Hey, Aptor over there. Whoa. Look at all these. Look at these three crystals. They're huge. They're in different colors too. Clearly, they stand out from the other crystals. On the way here, we didn't see anything out of the ordinary. So I think these three crystals are clues, Abder. They must be keeping a secret. Makes sense. I feel the same way. On the journey to Fogbound Lake where we met Uxie. Ah, watch out, step back, everyone. And <laughs> the nuke went off. Groudon Stone statue held the secret. Then on the way to Underground Lake where we met Mesprit. Ready, one, two, three, go. <laughs> then they died. The quicksand pools allowed a passage in Underground Lake. Could this place lead to his elf's lake? It should be like those other two places. There should also be a secret here. Well, this crystal changes color when you touch it. This crystal change, co changes color when you touch it too. This might have something to do with solving this place's secret. Try touching them for yourself after. Come on, visions. Color does change when I touch it, and I could, and it can change into a variety of colors. Are we in an actual puzzle? 
Three crystals. Changing colors. What could this all mean? Ah, here we go. Oh. It's starting again. A dimensional scream. It's so weird when he says it. Like, I see. The three spiritual elements of knowledge, emotion, and willpower. Zelf is the being of willpower. Willpower is the motivation that drives us. It's a unifying power. To unify us, it's unify is to make one. So if the colors of the crystals were made one, the past should reveal itself. What is the color of Elzef's spirit? That is the question. Zelf lives at Crystal Lake. Then Elzef's spirit must be affected by the crystals. Good luck, after. I mean, I know what color a Zelf is, but you sure as hell don't. That was... Unlike my earlier experiences, all I heard was a voice. No, that's wrong. This... This happened once before. It was... It was a Gredon statue. I heard only a voice that time, too. Why does that happen? What did I hear only a voice then? And now? Hey, what's the matter, Raptor? Uh, Quincy, you should be kind of like a little bit snappier about it for nowadays. Like, if you if you see him just kind of spacing out, I mean, he does space out a lot. He's he's a very he's a very quiet guy. Do you have another vision? Did another dimensional screen come to you? I knew it. So, so what did you see? According to that voice, Zelf is the being of willpower. The voice said the crystals should all be made one color. Make the crystals one color. That's it. I need to match the color. These three, these three crystals need to all be the same color. Guess you have an idea of what to do. Now, what's the color supposed to be? The color of willpower. That must mean the color of his elf spirit. His elf lives at Crystal Lake, Crystal Cave, and Crystal Lake. Is his elf spirit as clear as crystal? Or no? Could it be the color of cold water? This is, you don't, my boy's reaching, but he's right. I guess you really have an idea about what to do. Okay, I'll leave it up to you, Aptor. See if you can solve the secret of the three crystals. Oh, it is a puzzle! Oh, that's the one. Thanks. I really hope we still get to save. Oh, God. <laughs> I like the, the, the two, the, the, the magazine and uh, mirror just like, what are they doing? <laughs> what did we get roped into? Ah, tremor! The dangerous after. Let's back off. Whoa, whoa! Omega crystal. Oh, that's dope. Wow, what is this? That's what a big jagged opening in the middle. Do you think we should go down through there? Maybe that leads to his elf's lake. Those three crystals were the key after. They opened a path that may lead to the time gear. Let's go after. Onward to his elf's lake. Please. No. Wait. No. <laughs> That's fine. It's fine. Float soul. It's, we got the important part, which is... uh getting our moves back. Ew. Is that poison or is that just water? This is for me. Delicious. A reviver seed? I will be taking that. Hell yeah. Crystal Crossing. Giving me the Monster Hunter vibes. It's asleep. We don't need to bother it. I don't even know what it was. That sucks. Uh, maybe I found another heal seed along the way? No. That's okay. We'll be out of here before no, in no time. Giving me this like bit of an Isaac vibe. All right, 
I can't get out of here without another one being poisoned. So, which one do I hate more? <laughs> Sorry. The red one's just cuter. I get that the colors are supposed to be like opposite, like mine and you would normally associate with the color red, but they, they want to swap it. All right, he's catching up. Uh, I'm gonna swap with you. I can get some HP back this way. Is my HP going off the screen? It is. Oh lord, he coming. Food. Get me out of here. And so this is basically another full size dungeon, so probably fifteen floors. I love them being able to finish the job with Quick Attack. Quick Attack's such a good move. Having the range advantage like that is... Mwah. Speaking of... Yay! Did we get so much XP too? Bye. <laughs> you did it. You scared us. We're out. Lately. Water pulse. Actually, hold on. We have a water type. Even at a distance. Oh, no, okay. Quincy can learn it. I mean... He's got bubble beam and bubble beam... I mean, let's take a peek. I don't think it'll kill us. Like, I don't think it'll ruin the TM if we don't use it. Water, be Water Pulse has more space. Line of Sight, Special, and Confused is really good. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. It'll tell us the power now. Five, four. Five, five. Yeah, we love that. Nice. And now... We litter. <laughs> well, I was <laughs> I also need to start working on a voice for Azelf. But... <laughs> <laughs> well, I was going to join... I was really going to help you guys. Scope lens. Cool. I mean, I'm not wearing it, but you know who can? My favorite of the two. <laughs> Um, so I was like, I'm gonna, I was gonna help you out, but then you like loot, polluted the ground. So you threw just some junk in the water. That's not good. Okay. Luckily the snow didn't reach just back to the back line. Gross. Is that Absol? Homestar? Is that you? Hell yeah. Copycat. Causes the user to unleash the same move as the last one used by facing uh, by the facing enemy. Some moves can't be copied. No thanks. Very cute. And I hope... Oh no. I actually don't want to reveal too much. No, no, no. I wonder what other games that Plus Love Mine I can learn copycat in. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. You got him. Oh, and it saved. He saved the PP. The saver of PPs the world over. <laughs> I am a child. Da -da -da -da. Gross. Bye.
fine. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. No. But then there were three. I should probably use some Mega Drain here. Man, Stab Boost is one hell of a drug in this game. I guess in the first game, too. Oh, it's a lit. That's a. I'm not insane, right? That's the lady symbol. Don't do it. You can't just. My first, my first instinct was ABBA, but I actually don't know any songs. If that even is a band, I'm pretty, that might just be a musician. That's fun having another uh, ah. Please. Oh god. <laughs> Mira. I know that's fun. Shit. It's fine. It's fine. We'll figure this out. There we go. <laughs> Serious plays with Africa way too much. I think a lot of places. I, I don't need this right now, but I am going to pick up this Petra Berry. Alright, you know what? We're, we're just all getting poisoned. Toto, join in on the front. Get poisoned with us. But it's true, yeah. A lot of <laughs> Africa by Toto gets a lot of mileage. Uh, this one's for Quincy. Yikes. That's the only way to feed your Pokemon in Mystery Dungeon. Not, not like actually, but it's the only real way. It's the only fun way by throwing it at mock speed at at your friend's mouth. Apparently there's a speaker in African Desert that is playing it non-stop. <laughs> Just really hoping for the rain. You're ba welcome back to the 24-7. Oh, man. From downtown hitting with the water pulse. Welcome back to your 24-7 non-stop source for all things Africa by Toto. <laughs> Halfway point? No, we're there. I still haven't thought about the voice. No, I got it. I got it. I got it. Depending on uh, like its uh, like its demeanor. Hey, it was a big one. Look after it's a lake. Oh, incredible! Look at all those crystals emerging from the lake's surface. Oh, that's some time gear energy. Is this lake where his health lives? Hey, Abder, look over there. Look, in the middle of the lake. The the scenery in this game is so much nicer, like with these like, panning shots. Where it's like an island. I think I see someone. Let's go. No, <laughs> Dude, Quincy, how are your eyes so good? Hey, what's happening there? Oh, that's not a good sign. That's, that's Grovile. Ah, oh, shit. It's the freaking, it's the vision. I was talking about all the shinies he got. I made total fun by making it to, uh, totally fake names. <laughs> ah, that is, that's fair. Pokemon not, isn't everybody's bag. Uh, uh. Now I'll take it. Time gear. No, you can't take it. Never. This is, this is what I saw in my vision during the dimensional scream. The vision I saw then, it was an event of the future after all. Who is that over there? A Zelf? If it is, the Zelf's in trouble. Let's go help. Hurry. Oh shit, is this where it goes down? Now, sunk down there. That's the time gear, isn't it? Fine then, a Zelf, wasn't it? I must apologize, but I must take that time gear. Uh, wait. Hold it. 
Go vile. You know, my name? Grovile the Thief. I heard from Uxie and Mesprit that you were coming. I would have been I would have been better off if I just knocked you out directly. But I also thought I could possibly lose. So I set up a failsafe system. What? Aw oh, shit. What did you do? Ah! Tremors! Dude, she's gonna freaking bury us. This is the lake is covered by crystals. There's no way. There's no way of getting the time get at the time gear. Grovile, the time gear. You'll never get it now, even if in exchange for my life, you'll never. You, I mean, I mean to have it, and I will get it. I need the time gear, even if it means eliminating you as elf. Stop. You're not stealing another time gear, Grovile. I have no quarrel with you. Out of the way. No, I won't move. Are you serious? And if you won't stand aside, you leave me with no choice. I'll knock you out first. Just try to stop me. Aw, uh, shit. Oh, okay. No, it's fine. It's fine. We're just going to... Let's just take a moment. Think about our options. Warp seed. Hyper beam. Why don't we pick that up? Can't use any of those. Blast seeds. Okay. I have analyzed the situation, and it is now time to start hucking rocks. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I mean, he is a grass type, so he's gonna resist this, but also it's good to start getting that withdrawal going. All right, Quincy, I need you to be careful here, my guy. Nice. Love that. Love that for him. Rude. That was... <laughs> you know, can't win them all. Oh, that's not how I remember the fight going. Ah. Uh. Oh, shit. Get out of the way. I, I can't talk. But I won't step aside. You refuse, and you leave me with no choice. No! Quincy's in serious trouble, but I can't move. Uh, this is all for the time gear. Forgive me. Ah! Oh, what is this? Of, I, I don't... Is this... Oh, there's so many people that this could be. Stop. Aw, oh, shit. Ah! Oh, Desnor. Are you alright, Quincy? Please, let me handle this. Ah! Oh, that was a good animation, him picking up. It's never something you would encounter with normally in-game. You! It's been too long. Oh, shit, they know each other. It wasn't easy finding you, Grovile. What was that? The Great Duskborn knows Grovile? Ah, even here. You chased me even here. You're tenacious, all right. You cling to me with it beyond expectation. Grovile, you're not getting away this time. Dustnor. I'm surprised to see you in this world. Huh? Wait. Hold the, hold the fucking phone. Aw, oh, shit. There's no way. They're not about to dump that these are also humans, right? But I'm ready. So you'll fight. And so be it. But can you win against me? Aw, oh, shit. Oh, my God. Grovile vanished. I blessed it, Grovile. He never intended to fight me at all. There's no escaping me. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Great Dustnor vanished too. What just happened? I don't understand. Well, he is a ghost, but it is very possible that they're going for something that's not just ghost stuff there. Uh, trying to move. I can't. I can't. I'm feeling faint. Eek! There, there they are! I just said eek. Hey! Hey! Come on! Hurry! <laughs> Man, they were out there for like seven days and they didn't get here and we found it in like five minutes. Oh golly, they're down! Hey! Are you alright? They're badly hurt. Hey, we need to get them back to the guild for treatment. 
the, the, we got our asses kicked that bad. They need to. We need to go to like the guild ER room. All right. <laughs> I'm more worried about Mira and uh, Toto. They're, they're just frozen. <laughs> the sinews of the forest area. We might be getting a new side adventure too. Not that I'm like doing those right now. Oh, are you awake? No, I'm not going. Are you watching over us? That's not. That's that's cute. That's not creepy at all. I'm I'm being serious. It's just cute. Where? You're in your room at the guild. You were both hurt. We've been sleep. You've been sl <laughs> we've been sleeping this whole time. You've been sleeping this whole time. Are you all right after? Whew! My God, hear it. I remember passing out at Crystal Lake. Seems like I can speak again. That's that's such a weird bit. Why why was he not able to speak? Oh, what about Azelf? Is Azelf okay? He's fine. Quincy, compared to you two, his injuries weren't that severe. Oh shit. I mean, we did. Azelf's probably a much more powerful Pokemon than we are. Like we, he probably was able to hold off. Dude, Grovile's cracked. He fought Azelf and the two of us. Even after we kicked his ass. And he uh, he was probably just holding back now that I think about it. He's like, nah, I'm done. I'm done now. It's time to go serious mode. And then he kicked our asses. He regained consciousness, er consciousness early, earlier. Earlier. He's in the guild now. Oh, excellent. I'm glad you're okay too, uh, Quincy and after. I should let the guild know you're awake. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Everyone, they're awake. Aww. Aww, even, even Sans Undertale. Even, uh, Krogunk. Really awesome! Aww, Loudred. Oh my gosh, that's wonderful news! Oh, I'm mighty glad. If anything would have happened to you all, I. I. Oh. You guys are getting so emotional about this. Oh, that's right! There's something that I need to share with everyone. Hi. And what would that be? What? What did you say? You're saying that the great Dustnoir and Grovile, they may have known each other from before all this? Yes, it sounded that way when they were getting ready to fight. Well then, what became of Dustnoir? Well, Grovile escaped. I think he went off in pursuit. The emergency siren! We have an emergency siren? Hey, Diglett, what's the matter? That's an alert from Magnemite! I'm told it's, I'm told it's an emergency call all sent out by Officer Magnazone. Deputy Magnemite, please show your message down to the sentry post. Please speak clearly. Can you hear me? This is about an important announcement from Officer Magnazone. Everyone, please gather at the main square in Treasure Town. We will have a major announcement to make for everyone. All Pokemon in the area have been called for this town meeting, not just those in the guild. That is all. We hope for your cooperation. Thank you. What's happened now? An important announcement. What might it be? Hey, no point in wandering. Let's get a kid an answer. Hey, let's get moving. Treasure Town's Man Square. <laughs> Corfish stepping it up. Aw, oh, shit. Oh, Dustnor's back. Oh, look. The guild members. <laughs> the, 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 the long. I can't believe their sprites look like that. <laughs> Long fairy creatures. The tails are just erect. So the kills Pokemon were even called. For them to be called, something serious must be happening. As Elf! Oxy! Mesprit! I don't. <laughs> are you alright? You're not hurt? Yep, I'm okay. The Time Gear. It's in Crystal Lake. It'll be safe there without your protection. It can't be stolen. Yep, it'll be safe for now. The time gear is protected by an increasing cover of crystals. Stealing it won't be easy. Hey, Duskmoor, sir! Ah, Quincy and Aptor. You're all safe, I'm so relieved. Duskmoor, sir, I'm glad to see you're back, too. Thank you for saving us. So, can you tell me what happened? What happened to Grovile? What became of him? I gave chase to Grovile, but he slipped away from me. Um, Duskmoor, sir... Back at Crystal Lake when you were fighting Grovile. Dustnor, sir, you and Grovile seem to know each other. What was... If I may interrupt, 
They're great test no our plans. I don't know why I'm giving everyone British accents now. The great test no our plans to explain what he knows, and that topic will be included. Now, everyone, gather around, please. Oh, we got the whole squad. Golly, I wonder what all this could be about. Who knows? Don't ask me. Everyone is here. So, I would like to get this meeting started. Our topic, the rash of time gear thefts. Several time gears have been stolen by the Pokemon Grovile. In the regions where time gear has been stolen, the flow of time has come to a standstill. This is a serious problem, as I am sure you can guess. Grovile failed. Failed to steal a time gear. The, this one was protected. Wow. Isn't that something? And the hero who protected it was the mighty Zelf. And the hero who saved his health was chased off Grovile. That would be the great Duskmore right here. Yeah, that's astounding. I wonder he's such a famous explorer. Officer Magnazone, I'm sorry to interrupt. Perhaps I should explain from here. Of course, please take it from here. Everyone, while we should be happy that we protected the time gear this time, the fact is, Grovile remains at large. Therefore, we cannot afford to feel safe and secure. Grovile will most certainly make another attempt to steal the time gear. There is another matter that is tied to all of this. It's an extremely important matter that I must share with you. I would like to explain it to you now. First, earlier Quincy asked me the following question. Did I know Grovile from before all this happened? That is correct. I do know Grovile from before all this. What? What I'm about to say may be beyond your belief. But it also happens to be the truth. Aw, oh, shit. Aw, oh, shit. Furthermore, if what I'm about to reveal isn't stopped, calamity is certain. I therefore ask for your undivided attention. First, Grovile is... Grovile is a Pokemon that came here from the future. Aw, oh, shit. The f future? Dead? <laughs> No, no. <laughs> He's talking to Doug Trio. He's not like, is Grovile my dad? What does he mean by from the future? I think he means from a place where things are yet to happen. But is something like that possible? A Pokemon coming from the future? Grovile. In the world of the future, he will be a notorious criminal. He was at a large bounty on his head. To avoid capture in the future, he fled. And in fleeing, he escaped to this, a world of the past. After arriving in this time, Grovile plotted, till he hit upon an utterly catastrophic plan. What is that? What is his plan? It is nothing less than causing the planet's paralysis. The planet's paralysis? Yes. If a planet becomes paralyzed, all movement upon it ceases. When a time gear is removed, the flow of time slows in its region. As many, as many more are taken, time slows in an ever larger area. Eventually, the planet's flow slows down so much that it stops entirely. Ultimately, the planet reaches a state of total paralysis. If the planet is paralyzed, what happens to this world? In a world where the planet has become paralyzed... Aw, oh, fuck. No winds blow. The day never comes. Neither spring nor summer ever comes. It's a world of unrelenting darkness. It would be no exaggeration to call it the complete ruin of the world. The world's ruin? Is that what happens if the time gears are taken away? It's our way time has been going out of control lately. That too is caused by the thefts of the time gears. If the time gears continue to be stolen, this world will end in ruin. So what, what, what would happen? So that's what would happen. This is bad. We gotta do something. Hey, I have a question. God damn it, Corefish. There's something I don't understand. Yes, what is it? I understand that we've got a big problem on our hands. But what I don't understand... Well, hey, it's about you, Dust Norser. Why do you know so much, Dust Norser? I mean, I know that the great Dust Norser is knowledgeable and wise. And sure, I really respect you and all. You're alright, I guess. But how would you know the future, no matter how knowledgeable you are? That's true. 
I'm the thing. Ah, yes. What Corfish said makes perfect sense. Under normal circumstances, it's true. There's no way that I should know these things. So why do I know these things? It's because I, too, am a Pokemon from the future. What? Dustner is another Pokemon from the future? By gosh and golly, this is all so complicated, it's making my head spin. My objective is to capture Grovile. It's for that reason that I came from the future. I need to know as much as possible to ensure the capture of Grovile. I therefore studied everything I could about this world while in the future. That is why I know so much about this world. Why didn't you say anything before? I'm... I'm sorry. I have felt terrible not saying anything. I'm sincerely sorry for not revealing my identity. I am full of contrition. But... What if I had been open about my identity from the start? What would happen if I had said that I was from the future? Who would have taken me seriously? Uh... Also, I need to avoid alerting Grovile in my presence. I decided that I should keep my identity hidden while I went about with my work. It makes sense. But... It is also a fact that I have been deceiving you. For keeping silent about my identity. Ah, we were deceiving you too about the whole, uh... Uh, first lake thing. It's okay. I sincerely apologize. No, 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 no. Please, don't apologize. You can't blame yourself. You had no choice. Sorry, I'm getting a bit of a... been hanging out with Grovile too much. I concur. Dust Noir has been done nothing wrong in my book. We should focus on it. Our anger on Grovile. <laughs> oh, no. The SPW, quick, change the thing before you make a joke. We must somehow capture him. Yeah, we're in deep trouble if we let Grovile go on. We need to catch him before the world gets ruined. Destiny, sir, I'll be glad to help. Me too. By golly, me too. Hey, count me in. We will cooperate as well. I refuse to remain a victim. We won't let him steal another one. <laughs> Some sudden protagonist shift to Dustnor. Hey, everyone, thank you so much. We, as Pokemon, must all work as one. To capture Grovile. Then put an end to Grovile's calamitous plot. Yeah! Something's still up. Does no, sir. In order to obtain the time gear from Crystal Lake, Grovile knows that he has to defeat me. So if he's still he, if he's still after my time gear, Grovile will come after me. We could turn that against him. Mesprit, Zelf, and I can go to Crystal Lake. Then we can all spread rumors claiming that we have gone to steal the time gear so it can never be stolen. And if we did that, do you think it would provoke Grovile to strike? I see. You're suggesting we bait the trap. Yep. But that would mean exposing you to danger as the bait. I'd like nothing more. If that means stopping Grovile, we're ready to take that risk. And I understand. Everyone, let me explain our plan. Please pay attention and do your part. First, I would like everyone to spread a rumor far and wide. Get the world the word out there that three Pokemon, Uxie, Mesprit, and Zelf, spread word that the trio has returned to Crystal Lake to seal the time gear away. Please spread the rumor as much as possible. I see. So you want word of this to reach Grovile's ears? That's correct. But Grovile won't be convinced by rumor alone. That's why I must ask the trio of Uxie, Mesprit, and Zelf to do something. I must ask to actually go to Crystal Lake. I understand. That then when Grovile shows up and finds his elf and the others, that's when we can catch him. I get it now. Oh my gosh, I'm all fired up with, up with excitement. Arrest. <laughs> Arrest. Oh no. Hey, I'm calling it. I'm going to be the one to catch Grovile. No, it's my duty to catch criminals. <laughs> oh god. I don't want to get outdone by the others. Let's do our let's do our best too, Aptor. I'm sorry. I'm grateful for your kind offers. But for the capture, the capture. <laughs> That's when we capture someone and put it with a big pile of crap, and they get stuck in it like a bear off in Monster Hunter. But for the capture of Grovile, I must. I would prefer to work alone. What? Why? Grovile will be extremely wary. Even if he is, if he were to realize that his elf and the other two have truly gone to Crystal Lake, he will be cautious in the extreme. So if we were to lay a massive ambush for him at Crystal Lake, he will undoubtedly notice the unusual number of Pokemon in the area. 
I'm afraid Grovi will not be lured out by his elf and the others that way. So I must apologize and insist upon capturing Grovi by myself. Oh, I get it. That's too bad. I'm terribly sorry, Quincy. <laughs> Quincy. Quincy. The little pip plop Quincy. It's time I hope to capture Grovi without any mistakes. Please forgive my selfishness. That's how it stands, guild members. Up to now, we were capturing Grovile. Yep. Ta! <laughs> hey, that's my line! At least, that was the plan. This time, stay out of it. We'll provide support only as needed. Well, hey! If that's what it takes. We have no choice? Is that an acceptable plan, Guildmaster? Yep. Thank you for confirming that. Ooh, he stayed awake, thank goodness. Thank you for hearing me out, everyone. I realize I'm asking a huge favor, but please do your part in our plan. And let's capture a grove Isle using whatever means necessary. Maybe not any means necessary. Yeah. <laughs> and thus. Set off Crystal Lake. In the meantime, the other Pokemon busied themselves. Spreading rumors that his elf and the others were about to steal, steal the time gear away. As for Pokemon and Wigglytuff's guild. That's the current situation. Until everything is resolved, we ask that you go do about your regular duties. Yes, we would like to spread the rumor as much as possible, but not so much that it would make Grovile suspicious. Try to be natural. Go about your jobs in the usual manner. Oh, it's <laughs> freaking, uh... Uh, what's his name? Loudred. I can be subtle. Oh, can you guys hear the Grovile? It's not. God damn it! I already messed it up. The, the, the three like Pokemon are stealing time gear away. Man, sure would suck if someone were to go after them and attack them and, with their most vulnerable. And when possible, spread the rumor. That is what we would like you to do at least for the next few days. That is all. All right, everyone, let's have another good day of work. Hooray! <laughs> ah, you too. Today, take blah 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 blah. blah. All right. Bigger bag? No way. There's a Sunflora episode. Oh my god. Look at this weird ass sprite. It looks like they're holding the pencil. Oh my god, we get to play as it. We get to play as Sunflora? This reminds me. Just a, just a peek. <laughs> After getting the, the 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 beauty of voice going, thanks to Kroger, I haven't been. <laughs> that's that's wiggly tough. What is what does he sound like? I've already forgotten. Ah, oh, golly, thanks to Kroger, I haven't been able to get a good night's nice sleep lately. There's nothing to do if you're awake at night, so I took a stroll through the guild. Yup, yup. I glanced at Quincy and After's room, but they were deep in sleep, by golly. I reckon they must be exhausted from their daily training. Yup, yup. I didn't peek into Chimeco and Sunflora's room. Oh, Chimeco's Sunflora. It makes sense. I, they, they're both girl-ish. I'd be downright rude. Yeah, imagine going into someone else's room and, like, reading their diary. That'd be super rude. Huh? Diary? You wanted me to peek? <laughs> oh, diary, I could never... I would never be so rude just to look at someone's. I surely can't do that. I just, it's just not done. Oof, <laughs> that down. And sneaking into the Guildmaster's room was too scary, so I gave that a pass and kept nosing around everywhere. Now that chat top, by golly, that one gave me quite the start. So, Diary, where did you reckon that chat top sleeps at night? Well, surprise, surprise, he sleeps on the top rung of the guild's entry ladder. When I crept nearby, he thought I was trying to run away, by golly. So he wildly- oh my god. I'm still sore all over. Why, why can't the Pokemon leave, Chatot? Why can't they leave at night? P.S. Crystal Cave sure lived up to its name, being full of crystals and all. Surely it was a pretty place. It was so pretty I couldn't help open myself to a crystal. My own precious treasure. And everyone found out about it. All I got was a bunch of grief. 
wild. All right, let's save, and then we got more guilt. We got more stuff to do. Man, these sessions they go by so fast. All right. Uh, let's take a peek at these. Don't I already have this? I'm pretty sure I already have that. Anareth, Wooper, Magmar. Okay. I would like it if it just made it so that once you have an item, I mean, I'm, I don't know if they even stack. All right. Let's just empty this out. I think we're better off than bees these days. <laughs> Another, oh, that's a tingling. Oh, we haven't even been to Tiny Meadow. Might as well go explore that, though. It looks like it's going to be pretty weak. All right, we got Northern Desert. Okay. And then there's a Northern Desert here. Although I don't know if I have any cherry berries. Okay. So Tatshot just sleep, like sleeps on that top rung of the ladder. So let's go see if this over here has a cherry berry. Nope, not well. Actually, hold on, not yet. Why do I still have this in here? Damn. Um. Let's see if you are selling one. I, I should be reading these. No. All right. Well, we'll just have we'll just hope that we find one along the way. For, uh, I would find a cherry bear along the way. Another thing that happened off stream was, uh, I was in here and then I won the big lottery. And then a bunch of Pokemon bust in from the back room here, like physically demolished this part of the wall and started dancing as a bunch of uh perfect rotation perfect rotation i'm stealing someone else's bit <laughs> i've never it's very satisfying uh i'm sure this isn't drawing to anybody watching the stream uh it was a bunch of blossom and ludicol and one ludicolo and they were like dancing like to celebrate the big one are you gonna tell me now What a jerk. Uh, I don't really have anything to give him. Let me guess. More discoveries have been made. Oh. Also, he's been starting to... Actually, these probably happened during the last stream. He was starting to offer, like, really good items if you have what you need, what we need. But we don't have what he needs. Well, now I don't want to... Oh, unless... I, uh, maybe I can trade for Warren Berries? I can. But I only have two apples. Can I make apples? No. Okay. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six. What's he looking at? What's he looking at back there? 
Thank you for not just giving me another ticket. No, I, I already know what the offer is. Hold on, give that to what's his face? Mix elixir. And then there's a vile seed in here. Wonderful. I might start hoarding this stuff if it means giving me a chance to get like calcium and stuff. Oh, that, I mean, that's a lot of money. I can't be that upset about it. Uh, so let's, let's put the, the group, although if we're going to Great Desert, there's probably a lot of ground type, but that's fine. Plus, all of mine are not really using electric moves. So we sell this. Okay. I, was, I thought he was letting us sell directly from the... What's it called? We'll sell directly from inventory. But just let me. It's just let, it praise all. Jinx. Togepi. Ew. T don't call it Togepi, do. That's weird. <laughs> Charmander? I was like, what the hell? Like, ch like Charmy. Like the bee. Munchlax. That's one thing I'm still trying to grind out in Pokemon Blue. There is a chance that Munchlax appears, which is really funny because he's a Gen 4 Pokemon, because it was kind of like in between. Uh, but apparently it's so rare that like people like will not see it in their entire playthrough. All right. Wait, I did open them all right up, right? Yeah. So we'll deposit those. Uh, I'll make sure there's not any other loose ends in the box. One and two. They don't need a scope lens. What they need is some dang. Uh, some hell items that boost defense. Or something like that. Um, hold on to the money because we are going to go see Krogunk. That's right, I already looked at these. Alright. Deposit the money, go on the job. Oh, I also need to rearrange the team again. That's true. Uh, Dust Call brings up a good point. Like, what the hell? I mean, it makes sense. We are talking about, like, time is, like, a central theme here. Uh, and I was ready for there to be, like, other humans. But it seems that that's not the case. Sorry, Toto. And bring Maxine back. Okay. We got the team set. Oh, right. Let's actually take the jobs. This just seemed like so much more of like a, like a, I don't know. This seemed like a, 
What's the word? Like, they intend- like, everyone gets this one. Scripted. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Okay. Northern Desert we go. Hopefully we find the Cherry Berry. And then after that, we'll go to Tiny Woods. Or Tiny Meadow. Whatever it's called. That's not the one from Pokemon Blue, we swear. Now we want... 9, 10, 14. On one hand, I should probably be exploring all the floors to see if I find a cherry berry, but... Eh. Good hit. One day we'll get x-ray specs. There are x-ray specs in this game, right? There are x-ray spe There's... <laughs> they brought back x-ray specs, right? <laughs> I mean, they're really dumping us into the... Into the, like... Not complexity is not necessarily the right word, but like there's traps and everything. Like they're kind of throwing us into the deep end faster. Throwing throwing into the deep end's not the it's not it doesn't have the right connotation because that makes it sound like it's overwhelming. Oh god. Nice. That water pulse had extra stank on it from all the sand in there. Sandstorm doesn't do as much damage anymore. I just noticed. What are these missions going to turn into? We're already getting like S tier one, like star tier st uh, missions. They're gonna have to invent a whole new alphabet for the for the post game. Or they're not, and these are going to become very easy dungeons. <laughs> or the diff, or the uh, the range of difficulty will change. I don't know. Don't think I've forgotten about blue. I've been uh, doing a little bit of grinding out there too, getting new Pokemon. We actually got a friend bow from one of the trips to. I think it was one of the it was it was like one of the water type dungeons like in like underwater kind of thing and we got a friend bow and a tight belt which they were saying was only available through the one things but clearly that's not the case why am i not hitting my shots oh that's not helping there we go Imagine if they were showing the percentages of like hit chance. Uh, there's a, there's a not even a bit. It's more like actual like researched evidence that humans are so bad about like accepting per, uh, percentages that a lot of video games lie about their percentages to make people feel better. Like if it says ninety percent, basically a uh, any person. Like, the average person would assume they're going to hit every time, even though that's literally not how statistics work. But also, at the same time... Hello. Oh, no. It's a monster house. Oh, yeah? You're not locked in here. We're not locked in here with you. You're locked in here with us. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Bonk, bonk, bonk. <laughs> ah. Yes, the growl, my boy, vaccine. How do you all think you're going? <laughs> Damn. 
With all the snipes. Oh, they're gonna kill him. They're gonna ruin him. <laughs> ah, they're all like trying to crowd into the door. It's so funny. Cool. That guy's tough. Nah, we're good. Damn, that was a murder. <laughs> like, they got us- they got us surrounded, and then we- we hold up this orb, this magic orb, and they're like, Oh god, we gotta go, we gotta get out of here! <laughs> Damn. It'd still be nice if I could hit my moves. Oh, hi. Yeah. This is Ryder, but he has to spell his name different because he's cool. Goodbye, Ryder. That's so. That's such a great way to cheese getting friends, because they don't have to worry about losing them. That's wild. We do not need copycat in our lives. Though that is a very fun move. The trouble with copycat is that so many Pokemon are resistant to their own moves. It's just like, what's the point? What's that yellow dot? Is that part of the ambush? Wait, what is that? Were there two jobs on the same floor? What the hell is that? Oh, it's our teammate. <laughs> what were you doing over there? I didn't even process that we only had three dudes here. <laughs> Maxine was just going down and haunting somebody. See who likes getting bit. Sorry, already got one, Mr. Chance. Still no cherry berry. Ah, shit. Oh, cool. Ba -na -na -na. Nice. Oh, you bitch! Did he move twice? He won't hit. He's confused. It is impossible for us to stop leveling up. Whirlpool! Like incapable of movement, it will inflict double damage on a diving target. Interesting. Nah, I don't think that's what we're here for. I, uh, his moves have been disabled this entire time, haven't they? Like during the past like two dungeons. Yep, they sure have, Bob. God. Ow, hey. Okay. A mirror might not make it. Don't say I never did nothing for you. It is. I love dead ends. Ooh. 
Wapa. Uh. Oh, good hit. Hey. Clown to clown communication going on right here. Help. <laughs> car wreck in slow motion. There we go. Fourteen. I mean, hey, if we find the cherry berry, we find the cherry berry. If not, it's not the end of the world. That comes later. <laughs> Good shit. We should also do a full clear of the room that they're in. Like, the, the floor that they're on. Just in case the game has some kind of, like, built-in protection for that. But, probably not. Am I out of? I am. Alright, we'll just walk up and suck all its life out. Food. We're being chased by a dude. I got two bites left. I got one bite left. Oh god. Oh god, kill him. Okay. Oh, no, it's another dude. This is... He's gotta have, like, a creepy name. He's gotta be, like, a... Phil. <laughs> Welcome to the team, Phil. Man, I'm in trouble when I get to my third game and then I just run out of dudes to name them. <laughs> Thanks for the health. Wow, you did a sure good job sucking all the life juice out of me. Can I be on your team? <laughs> sure, you weirdo. <laughs> oh, hey. Carnivine. Feeling, uh. Ba, 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 ba. Where's the letter N? It's over here. Bye. A uh, cherry berry! Oh. We just had to go find it. We didn't have to, like, bring one to him. Okay, cool. I love that way more than delivery quests. Nice. How is our inventory full? We have so much room in our bag. Oh, you know our bag probably didn't get bigger. Because I think it was just the thing about... Uh, we got four... Th they, they give the guild 4,000 for that. It's okay, I'm not doing anything with my money anyway. I'm still waiting for them to give us an egg. That's gonna be weird. Are still awake after? I have to admit that today was full of surprises. Great Dustin Wars talk about coming from the future. We, we just let, we just did our own thing. I guess that was like early in the morning when they did the meeting. That was mind boggling. Dustin War pursued Grofile from the future to our world? This is, a, it's still the same world. I don't know, why do they keep calling it that? I mean, I think it's, that's just a foible. I don't, I don't think that's, I don't think that's actually like, something I should be picking at. Like, that's not a clue. Uh, it's just weird that they're calling it a different world when it's just the past. We're 
is it? He came to apprehend that wicked Grovile? There's also some, there still might be a little something that might not be as clear cut as Grovile bad, does more good. To take him back to the future, Robocop style. After, have you ever seen the Robocop? I really like Robocop after. I think it's really cool. He like, <laughs> I actually haven't watched Robocop. I can't make any jokes. That's why the job of capturing Grovile is his responsibility. We have to trust us more about this. To be honest, I'd like to capture Grovile ourselves. But I'm not up to the task yet. Yeah, he kicked our ass. We don't have any choice but to depend on Dustin more after all. After? Guess you're asleep. I better get to sleep too. It'd be great if Grovile gets caught soon. Good night, After. <laughs> after is so uh, introverted, he can't even like strike up a conversation with his best friend. Who's gonna be crying when one of them no, but no doubt dies or leaves. Ah, oh, Bernard, oh, it's morning. Yes, well, good morning to you too. And save. Yep. 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 So today we're doing Tiny Meadow. Unless something else happens. Ahem. So here's where it stands. We have not yet received word about of Grovile's capture. Hey, our misspirited friend alright? We don't know that either. We've received no information at all. We're in the dark. That said, we can go off. We can't go off on our own and spoil the trap. We'll have to stand down until we receive word of some sort. Until then, we should carry on with our usual work. So, everyone, let's get back to work today. Hooray! It's good to see that people are still pretty jazzed up about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just about general exp exploration stuff. Hello, Krogan. I might already have that one. I definitely already have that one. Ball toy. May sail one of an enemy's known moves when it attacks the Pokemon. Cool. Uh, I definitely already have that one. I would love for them to be like, you already have this. Mine and tail. Was probably made from Vault Heart. God damn it. <laughs> Wait, no. This is a different one. Mine on card. I don't have mine on tail. No. Krogon, please. Please, give it to us. <laughs> Jinx. Togepi. Charmander. It just every time makes it seem like there's something weird, but it's like totally normal. Now will you give us a new cool thing? You will. It's a sp oh, that's so cute. It's a little tie. May restore the PP of one of the Pokemon's moves upon taking damage. Cool. It'd be cool if they had um tied for plus um, and minin. Oh, this all three are going into the wait, 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 wait. No, that's fine. Is that fine? Hold on. No, 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 no. This, this is getting rid of the attack defense and, and special defense to get this effect. It's fine. Give it to me. It's a higher rarity. I have to. Just for something to may. That's fine. Like, what if I be if I swap the team leader in the eventual post game to get. Uh, you know, to have Plusle being, or Minan, probably Minan, to be the team leader and getting that PP refund, that's pretty cool, especially because they'll be in the lead. <laughs> Ooh, spark tie! I can't believe this came out even after we all planned it. It, it feels like he's making fun of us every time. Like, whoa, look how special this thing is. All right, get me out of here. We are going to Tiny Meadow. Oh, hey. I think we're gonna absolutely body this place. But we gotta explore it. Can't be helped. Do we even get boxes? 
We got three box, two boxes. One day I'll have an egg. And I don't know, I don't know what's going to happen with that egg. Like, the idea is that they'll, well, they, they just give out, they just give po baby Pokemon, like, here they are, they join your team now. It's just weird. The appraisal begin. Okay. <laughs> Those are the same profile icons. It's like the hi, I'm really happy. All right, now I'm business. Now it's all business. This only hits one guy, right? Never mind. Can I store just a certain amount? Hold on. The hell is this? Gravel lock 10 shit. leave that alone we have one two three no I should put that other skateboard four five six we have one we have one trade to go do money for you I feel like one day they'll give us something like huge to do with. This is the wrong area. <laughs> what are you talking about, Chansey? What do you think about it? A Pokemon hatching from an egg. Wouldn't that be like coming from the future? No. Pardon? You didn't understand that? <laughs> that is true. It isn't an easy idea to grasp. I didn't understand when I said it either. All right, good. Get me out of here, you weirdo. She was also explaining it like it was the first time we'd ever talked to her. Get me out of here. She's creepy. Uh, look at them hanging out together. Uh, I don't think I actually have anything for you. Nah. What can I not afford this time? Yeah. Maybe it'll stay there and I notice keep the sleep seed on on tap, as, as it were. I should also keep the orange berries. Nice. I wonder if there's always like hit dud big win. I don't know. <laughs> Very in the dark of the mechanics of this. Look at the little Dratini. It crawled all the way up from. <laughs> I mean, I don't. Dratini actually live in the water. All right, we got the team. Let's go. I should probably go accept the job first. Tiny meadow. Wait, we're gonna have to get, leave someone behind. So let's go talk to Chime at Go, and leave Maxine. Oh wait, no, we we should leave Plusel behind. We should leave Mira behind. We only need the one. Besides, we've got a escort coming with us today. Cause we already did Landside Cave. That was where we got all those chests. Wait, wait, wait. Executor. Executor is level 7. Not great, but I guess the real question is what the level of these Pokemon are. Uh, poke this music putting me to sleep. 
Oh, never mind. Three and somewhere. I guess Executor will let us know when he's had enough. Orange berries are nice. Remember, the other thing we're looking for is the sleep seed. You bitch. Oh, I'm a grass type. I'm immune. Bam, 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 bam. Ah! All right, Quincy, I'm gonna need you to break out the vacuum cut. You swap. That's fine. That's good too. I don't think I have anything that's gonna make this easier for us. Just protect the client. I could change the weather. That's not gonna save us. All right, time to time to bulk up. All right, that's a good start. Yes, mine on my boy, Maxine. Quincy, where you at with the moves, my guy? Okay, let's get let's get you going after foes. Let's see if that'll help us. That's the way. We got some good team synergy going right now. I'm happy about it. Alright. Everyone's hitting me for one damage. I think I can start taking a fight to these guys. Ah, hey! Back up. Back up. Yeah, grind them down. Ah! Oh, that's- I think that's also where I got vacuum cut was from that, like, super special one. But I might be wrong. No, that was from an earlier thing. I don't know. I don't know what I'm on about. Dang it, they're mining. You got this. <laughs> yes! They're falling! Piplup with the pentakill! The- is that what- heptakill! Ah! My eyeballs! Uh, well, hang in, mining. I don't want you to die. Oh, you're still. Oh, that's right. You're the boss. Yes. Let's save their ass. Okay. No. Yes. Get that paralysis. Nice. Saved. All right. Dude, good teamwork, everybody. Uh, sorry, sorry, Minan, about this. Oh, that also reminds me. In blue, no, oh, there you go. He's dead now. <laughs> Rip to a real one, and that's why you can't do mystery dungeon nuzlocks because you do that, and then you're just like, sick. I have to sacrifice one of my guys. <laughs> All right, bye. Then there were two. Aha! Wow, that was a short ass dungeon. <laughs> Dude, look at Volbeat's face. Oh, yeah, we should go eat those gummies too. Beep -boop, beep -boop, beep -boop. They seem so nice, but then during the cutscene, they were like, "I cannot wait to, I cannot wait to arrest people." Ooh, nice. They really need to make a type of gummy that's like this hits. This everyone loves this type of gummy, like a rainbow gummy. I don't. Gold is for psychic, I think. Dude, Quincy, Dude, Qu we need to get you some like melatonin or something like that, my guy. Listen, after 
I wonder how his elf and his friends are doing. Do you think they might they may be fighting Groovile now? Oh, I just can't sleep with that on my mind. Alright, I can't blame him on that. But if you stop to think, this is all so strange. I mean, Pokemon coming from the future? Something like that is really possible? That's true. It's hard to accept that Pokemon could come from the future. Come to think of it, it's never crossed my mind before. The world of the future where Dresnor and Grovile came from. What is it like? Is the future like the present day? Is it, is it a world at peace? Uh, it's another early day tomorrow. I better force myself to sleep. It's not how that's not how it works, Quincy. You just you might as well just let your mind wander, but like make it wander to like your hobbies and stuff, not like your stressful stuff. I'm going to sleep after. Good night. Tomorrow, let's do our best. Good night. No. The next morning. I have been at this morning. <laughs> One of these days, he's just going to be like, Hey, guys, get up. Hey. <laughs> Sorry, I was out late night drinking. I'm not really feeling it this morning, so I'm just going to be like, <laughs> I don't want to be too loud today, so I'm just going to be like, Hey, hey, wake up. Um, about the attempt to capture Grovile. We have yet to receive word for the Grovile has been captured. I understand that you're all itching for something to happen, but consider this a test for your patience. B because we ask you to carry with your usual work. Oh, what's that siren? Deputy Magnemite is here. Oh, he's a deputy. That's so cute. This is a message from Officer Magnazone. We are pleased to deliver this report. Grovile has finally been captured. Oh my god. Wow, at last. Oh my gosh, Grovile's been caught. Oh my gosh, they did it, yippee. There's more. Grovile is captured by the great Dasnor. He has informed us that we will return to the future with Grovile. A bit sus. Dasnor is going home? Going back to the future? How do you go back? I do not claim to understand the process. I can also hear all of you, even though I'm still outside the guild, I think. But I have heard that they will be going through a tunnel. He called it a dimensional hole. He opened a dimensional hole in the town's main square, I am told. Dustinor told us that he wishes to say goodbye before he leaves. Okay, he's not evil. Therefore, he hopes he will come see him the last time at Treasure, Ho Treasure Town Square. Hey, we are, what are we doing here? Let's hurry, we have to go to Treasure Town. Don't, don't worry, Diglett, rub it in. Whoa! <laughs> what's the what's the what's the theme music from Mario and Luigi Partners in Time? Like, like bam, 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 bam. I, I mean, it's, it uses like Mario sounds, like you know, ba -da 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 -ba 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 -ba, but it's kind of like remixed a little bit. I don't know how to describe it. I'll play it for the next. I'll play it for the next opening. Everyone's already here. Hey, I don't see the great dust war around yet. Uh oh. What is that? This is a dimensional hole. Dimensional hole? Oh, what Magnemite was trying to explain earlier. Golly, this is it. Isn't it something? So stepping inside this here will take you to the future? <laughs> Watch out. Stay clear. The instant you touch it, you will be sent to the future. Please be extremely careful. Oh. Hey, Ooxie. Mesprit. And his elf too. Quincy, you're all safe. I'm glad to see that. Naturally. So was the plan successful? Yep. I have to hand it to the great Justinor. It was flawless. Rovile's been captured. We regained all the time gears he'd stolen. This is, this is awfully convenient. You imagine they just never talk about this subplot again and they just go off to something else. <laughs> yes, that's excellent. Just knew I should be I should be along shortly. Oh, what's that? This is the Great Dustnor. There comes the Great Dustnor. Everyone make way! Oh, I got them all. Oh, dude, they got him gagged. That's Grovile. He looks like a bad guy. That's for sure. So it's great. It's a great time. They finally caught him. The Sableye. The world was nearly ruined because of him. Everyone, today I would like to share excellent news with you. Finally, Grovile. Grovile's been captured. I wonder how many times you gag a villain. 
and how many times they actually end up being evil. That's usually something that you do when you don't want them to, like, defend themselves, you know? This was all made possible by your selfless support and cooperation. I can't thank you enough. As you can see, Growth Oil is a vicious and wicked Pokemon. His capture should result in lasting peace for your world. <coughs> Looks like they have Growth Oil muzzled. You can't say a word that way. But I must also deliver a sad piece of news. It is time for me to return to the future. Everyone, I must now bid you farewell. Huh. So that oh dude the music. <laughs> oh, so that was true, eh? Hey? I'm feeling the blues. There's so much I wanted to learn from you, yup yup. Who's he? Miss Bird is elf. I entrust you with the rest. Yep. I know. We got the time gears back. And we will make sure they return to their rightful places. The task is yours. Thank you very much for everything. You have literally saved us all. Oh no no. We have been most kind and helpful. I hope you will continue to work to reserve the peace. Yes, you can depend on that. Now, I'm afraid the time has come. <laughs> there you go. Everyone, oh it pains me. Oh. <laughs> awesome Flora, you big softy. I hate sad goodbyes. I hope we we'll see you again. <laughs> That's the one so Ah, yes. Before I go, I must see two Pokemon. Quincy, after. Let's us let's go up there. No, oh, Quincy. So this is really goodbye. Destor, sir, for everything you've done. Thank you sincerely. Well, this is goodbye. Or is it? What? It's too soon for farewells. Ah! You two are coming with me. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh, Quincy, after. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude. Dude, they got me with the sad music. What was... What just happened? Well... <laughs> Dope. I would like to save my adventure, yes. And that's where we're leaving it. No. <laughs> Into the future. The... Where is this? I was dragged? We can't losing consciousness again. <laughs> hey, you know this kinda looks a lot like the uh <laughs> like that one thing that Dustin was describing this. Whoa. I'm sorry to have kept you waiting, Master Dialga. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> well, I encountered more difficulty than anticipated. I finally succeeded. In the capture, yes. Oh. I fully understand what it must be done. Those who seek to alter the course of history must be removed from history. I will see you to the elimination immediately. Oh, oh my god. That, that'd be so wild if they just never give him a voice and he's just more or something else. Than, like a this, Sentience isn't the right word, but just like, he doesn't communicate with words. I understand. As you wish, I take my leave. Monkas. Monkas? Hey. After. Wake up, after. Ugh. Where? You're awake! This place, I think it's jail. What well, jail? I just woke up a while ago, so I'm not sure what's going on. In the and the. Oh, okay, cool. 
Uh, just don't go into too many details, because this is my first time playing the game. I tried the doors, but they're locked. There seems to be no, ma no other way out. I think we've been locked up. Ugh. Well, what's going on? We're locked up? I don't know what's going on either, but I may as well investigate. Oh, look at that map! After test the doors, the door was failed to open. It's no good. Like Quincy said, this door's won't open. Sure looks like we've been locked up. Hmm. How did we end up this way? I think what happened was Dustin would grabbed us. Then he dragged us into the dimensional hole. What? Wait, so is this maybe... Is this... The future? But that's... I can't believe this. I mean, this is the future? Why are we even here? Ugh, but... This whole room is constructed in a way unlike anything I've ever seen. Now that I've had time to digest this, maybe this actually is... the future. What? After? Did we really end up in the future? Uh, now what should we do? So if... if this place is the future, how are we supposed to get back to our world? Uh... Oh, that's not good. Thought we're gonna kick their ass. Don't, it looks like... It looks like they've got sensor bars over their crotches. They're awake! How convenient! Alright, we'll do this quick. Do this quick? Do what? Oh no. Ah! Ah, they blindfolded me! I can't see a thing! Come with us! Nah, don't shove me! Uh, this blindfold makes it impossible to tell where I'm going. Where are they taking us? We're here. That's a lot of rope. Someone worked very hard. <laughs> where is this? They have me trussed up. I can't move. Why is this happening? <laughs> Why do they have spotlights? Hey! <laughs> Great thing! <laughs> I'm glad to see you. You're okay, right? <laughs> You're close about what's going to happen. Guess you can afford to be nonchalant about it. Huh? That voice coming from over there. Grovile! You too. Do you have any inkling about where you are? No. This is a stockade. They're preparing to get rid of us for good. What? Get rid of us? Wait a second. It's easy to understand why they'd want to get rid of you, Grovile. You're, you're an evil, redeemless person. <laughs> but why us? We haven't done anything wrong. <laughs> Couldn't care less. Must have done. Well, you must have done something you can't. They can't tolerate. What? We haven't done anything bad. They don't think we're like you. I don't care. You're wasting time losing your cool. Meanwhile, look. Here they come. <laughs> oh, their butts have. Okay, at least their butts are censored too. Ah, who are they? They're the jailers who do all the dirty work around here. They also happen to be Dust Noir's underlings. What? The Great Dust Noirs? Hey, it's Dust Noir. Lord Dust Noir. These three have been tied to stakes. Good. Does Nor, sir? It's me, Quincy. Very well, Saber Eye. Those three, we need to be rid of them. What? Pay them no heed. You may get ready. <laughs> well, wait a minute, Does Nor, sir? What's wrong with you? What are you doing? Why are you doing this to us? Don't waste your breath. Instead, shh. Keep your voices down so they can't hear you. I keep my voice down? You too. If you want to get away, give me your full cooperation. What? Help you, Grovile? There's no time to think. Or would you prefer to stick around with her then? Psst. Hey, you there. Tell me. What can you do right now? What? What can I do? You ask me that out of nowhere. Um, what can I do? Oh, that's true. I do have items on me. I don't think I have any good... Uh, it would probably be a, a move then. I could do, like, Razor Leaf. Not that I can actually do this. We'll just... We'll, we'll let the game do its talking. Move. That could work. But... No. That's no good. We're trussed up. We can't move. It has to be something you can do instantaneously. 
Doesn't need to be flashy. Can't you do anything more basic? Uh, you're not helping. Um, what to do? Uh, none of those are gonna work. Nope, I just no good. Tied up. It's pretty something you can do instantaneously. Easy for you to say. Attack. That's it! That'll do. What are you on about? If you can't move to do a move, you can't move to attack. It's just a regular telk. I can help too. Good. We're ready to begin. Very well. Be, but be vigilant to the end. Don't take your eyes off them. Very smart villain. Not letting the... Well, I mean, they're literally taking their eyes off them right now. Especially that Grovile. <laughs> Commence now. <laughs> Little goblins. They're coming. Listen carefully. Sableye uses claws to strike. Did that make sense and scary? And that might just be the one open at uh, that might just open one avenue for escape. The Sableye will unleash their fury swipes in a frenzy. That's our that's our chance. They're just gonna their way to kill us is to rip us to shreds. That's wild. If even one of their attacks were to hit the ropes binding us. Oh right! The ropes might come loose. Exactly. And if that happens, lash out with an attack, then flee. But what if their fairy swords don't slash the ropes? What if what if the sable I don't use fairy swipes at all? If that happens, don't even think about it. Ah! Ah! And, and, endure it! Wait for your chance! But if they keep going, we'll be finished before that chance comes! Hey! There's a break in the rope! Now! Attack! Oh! Ah! What was this? There! Ah! I can't see! <laughs> That's the... Uh, goobers with their big gem eyes can't close their eyes. Compose yourselves! It's only a luminous orb! Its effects wear off quickly! That's not what luminous orbs do. Blast it! That Grovile! He fled using a flash for that luminous orb as cover! We won't get away with this! Come! <laughs> I must keep going. Wow, I can't believe that war. Oh, wow. They fucking dug under the ground. <coughs> I got dirt in my mouth. I thought they were just hiding behind the pillars. We're we're safe. So Grovile can use dig? He sure knows many moves. We got out of that scrape. But we're not out of the woods yet. Let's get out of here and fast. I would love to save my adventure. I can't stop. I've got to keep going. Come on, this way. We need to keep running until we hit the exit. Come on, faster. Pick it up. This is the fastest I could go. Quit ordering me around. Anyway, Grovile. What? Is this the future? That's right. You catch on fast? Huh, so it is, after all. And we're... Are we going to be able to get back to our world? Who knows? We just need to get away for now. If we get caught, returning home will be the least of your worries. Run faster! I can! I'm exhausted! <sighs> We're almost there. Look, the exit's right there. <sighs> we did it! Where? Outside! Wha wait, what is this? So what's Grovile's, what's Grovile, what's his horse in all this? This is our world in the future? Those boulders are floating. This is really a strange place. It's horribly dark. Not even the wind blows. It's as if all movement is as if everything stopped. Exactly. What? What? <laughs> ah, here those able eye. We have to keep running. This is Grovile, I'm exhausted. There's no time to rest. If they catch us, we're done. Tough it out and run. It's easy for you to say. I can't. I have to rest. Alright. This forms a natural alcove. It should shield us from view. 
After a quick rest, we'll have to get moving again. W wait a minute. When we escaped from Stockade, we, we cooperated with you because we had no other choice. We didn't promise we'd go with you afterward. A bad Pokemon like you. You're not worth trusting. Quincy. <laughs> so I'm the bad guy. And that Dustnor is the good guy? Then how about explaining Dustnor's actions earlier? It isn't just me. They wanted us gone on. Well, you go when had you gone too? Uh, but that doesn't mean I should put my faith in you, Grovile. Earning your trust isn't an easy task, it seems. I, th I thought that having allies would help, but there's no point continuing to together without trust. We'll go our separate ways. I'm staying on the move. You two should get moving as soon as possible. Good luck. Wait a second. You tell us to leave soon, but. It's dark out now. It's hard to see where we're going. Instead of setting off right away, shouldn't we wait for morning? Wouldn't it be better to leave when it gets light out? That is impossible. I hate to say it, but morning never comes. What? This world, your future, it's a world of perpetual darkness. The sun never rises, so morning never comes. Darkness persists forever. But why? Because the planet has been paralyzed. The planet is paralyzed? The planet's paralysis. The planet's paralysis! That's right, I remember now. Dustnor described the planet's paralysis before. If it was nothing less than causing the planet's paralysis. A planet's paralysis? Yes. If a planet becomes paralyzed, all movement upon it ceases. When the time gear is removed, the flow of time slows in its region. There's many more that are taken time slows in an ever larger area. Eventually, the planet's flow slows down so much it stops entirely. Ultimately, the planet reaches a state of total paralysis. If the planet is paralyzed, what happens to this world? In a world where the planet has become paralyzed, no winds blow, the day never comes. Neither, neither spring nor summer ever comes, it's a world of unrelenting darkness. Well, it would be an exaggeration to call it the complete ruin of the world. The planet's paralysis. I was worried all Pokemon would stop. Like, but it looks. It seems that that's that's okay. Sure, this place resembles Dustnor's description, but even then, it's hard to understand how the planet had been paralyzed in the future. You're free to believe or reject what I'm telling you. Either way, I suggest you leave here as soon as you can. I'm going. Don't let those Sableye catch you. <laughs> After? I don't know what to think anymore. Was the planet's paralysis supposed to be caused by all those time gears getting going missing? That's why we all tried to stop Grovile from stealing the time gears. We did everything we were supposed to do, right? Uxie and the others say they would return the recaptured time gears to their rightful places. That should have prevented the planet's paralysis. But despite all our efforts, why is the planet still paralyzed? In our future? Ah, I don't know what to do or what to believe anymore. <laughs> ah, the Sable Eye! We can't stay here after. Let's get ready Qu quickly so we can get moving. The uh, moo. <laughs> is, is the storage still there? Can we. Well, it's nice that they left the. I mean, we might as well. I mean, I don't know. I probably don't have my team anymore. So let's get rid of the stuff we can't use. Uh, we should keep that. Alright, that'll do. A step anywhere but I've never used. Alright. And then we'll take these gummies that came out. <laughs> That's nice that they never took the stuff out of storage. That's nice of them. They're like, man, we'll miss them. I'll keep all their stuff in... We keep all their stuff in uh, storage to remember them by, and why, or why not's like, hey, why not Le uh, give all the stuff to us and we'll trade it? All right, I think we got all the, yeah. Okay. You ready after? All right, let's do it. Let's go quick. Chasm Cave. We may never come back here. Ahow. I don't know what that move does. Apparently, it does nothing. 
Well, good to see there's still items. I guess if time stops, th then uh, these guys are scary. Come on, Quincy. Oh, it's a ditto. Um, if time stops, then things don't like age. So maybe all the Pokemon were there from, uh, you know, when time did stop and everyone just kind of stopped aging. And that's why the seeds would still be here. Maybe I'm looking too deep into this. Maybe I'm looking into it just the right amount. Ah! Okay, this is open air. That's what's letting this goober fly. I wonder if we can recruit anyone. The tied up scene was one of the few things I remember from the commercials. There was a scene where they get tied up and I'm like, all right, I was, I was probably like nine. <gasps> Drifloon, be on our team. Ah! Aftermath, damn. That is, a that is an ability. Hello, Skarmory. Oh, oh, Quincy, you're still set to go after boys. All right, stop, big, stop going after boys, please. Thank you. I also never realized that that UI meant that there was like a UI thing that's like, this is their current uh, tactic. Uh. Bye. I sure do love having these boxes. Maybe Grovile can open them up for us. Uh, that looks scary. Yeah, kick his ass. Come on, guy. Why are you getting sped up? Okay, thank you for not... Oh, unburden. That's cracked. Wait, no, you can't have... Jesus Christ. He's gonna get his ass kicked. Okay, I've got... Ah! <laughs> He's fine. I can never kill. The future's a scary place. Okay, um... No, it's fine. It's dark. Can't see. We could get jumped. Oh, the game too easy for you, huh, SPW? Or get a load of this? Shit. He's fine. Uh, no, I'm gonna get him right now. It's fine. This is quadruple ineffective. Never mind. We got there. Come on. You can make it. You can make it, Quincy. Apple. I've been meaning to make an art uh, for the fight with Grovile, and I'm gonna have to embellish it a little bit because we kind of kick Grovile's ass. But I, I'm I, I'm excited for what music I get to use next time. Yeah, kick his ass. All right, we love them multi-hit moves. We stand multi-hit moves around here. Coldest take of all time in a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game. Oh, I see the stairs. Shit. Ah! Joke's on you. Nom 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 nom. Man, he sucks up so much HP with that. I like that he's got a different play style from Tipa. Tipa was all offense, but this like self-sustaining ability. Gravel Rock, why does it look like that? 
Has it always looked like that? It definitely didn't look like that in blue. You know what? Let's sleep in Magnemite Lie. We're running for our lives. It's not like we're here to train up. There's a bit in a Pathfinder module where, uh, this is a little gross, so turn away if you don't want to hear it. Uh, look out! Yeah, kick his ass. Ooh. That's scary. Aftermath, that's a, that's some real shit right there. Uh, they're doing an execution, and the person that the PCs helped catch, like, the the like the 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 guards had cut out his tongue but you know you can't really tell it because you know it because it, it's like up on like a big like execution stand so it's not like people are like up close to see into his mouth but that way he couldn't like you know talk defend himself that kind of thing Look, Aptor! Could that be the exit over there? Let's go over there. Whoa, look at the water. Huh. <sighs> hmm. Can we put some distance between us and those Sableye? We probably. That place was scary. Let's rest a little now. Whoa, there's water there. What does it taste like, I wonder? What? This waterfall. This water isn't flowing at all. It's like a water. A water still. This gushing water is totally suspended in space. Is Grovile right after all? Has time really stopped in the future? Why did Dustnor bring us here? That's, that is still a mystery. The great Dustnor, who was so kind to us. I don't know what to believe anymore. The current theory, in my mind is that Dustnor recognized Apter's name. So in the future, he must have seen that Opter and Quincy were like big time heroes. And were like, I gotta nip that shit in the bud. Or my evil plan can't come to fruition for my dark god. If water is frozen in time, how do they fr hydrate? That's a good question. I don't know what to believe anymore. I still wonder what it tastes like. Does it? Does it still like... Do they, like, drink and then... <laughs> if only there's some way of finding the truth. And then how does, how does like, a water-type move work? Like, you shoot out bubble beam, and do they, like, stay still? Oh, I know. There's a way to set of getting to the truth, after. Huh? Your dimensional scream. Use a dimensional scream, after. Touch this frozen water. Who knows? We might see something. Oh, I understand. That's true. It's worth a try. Touching that frozen water might give us clues about what's happening to us. We can't dawdle. Those sable eye will catch up to us. Let's do this quickly. I have to touch the frozen spray of water. Well, after? Can you see anything? No. I'm not sensing anything. No, huh? <sighs> That's disappointing. That would have been reassuring if we could begin to understand what's happening. We didn't learn anything at all. We spent a lot of time here. If we don't hurry, those Sableye will get to us. Let's get ready to go, after. Alright. One more, one more, one more, one more. Oh, the music. One more dungeon, one more dungeon. Next save point. I stop. Oh, I never ate those gummies. God damn it. All right. Uh. Dark hill. All right. Step one. Feed. Uh, yeah, you can have this one. Oh, we got unlucky. That won't stop me. Joke's on you. Where's my sticks? Shit. Come on, Quincy. I need you. I need you to put a little bit more effort. It's fine. All right. Let's just sort this out. Yep. 
Uh, yeah, he's fine. I'm gonna. No, let, let me help him fight first. Well, good to see the chestnuts still work in the future. Okay. I didn't move. Synthesis. No. Mega Drain basically does the same thing. Except it also deals damage. But that's a dope move to have on a on a mystery dungeon Pokemon. Alright. Back to our picnic. I don't like having a picnic at the end of the world. Black gummy for you. Type advantage master. Nice. Th I believe that means he goes after... Attacking enemies with type disadvantage. Smart boy. Nice. Okay. Ah. I see that all of the spooky Pokemon survived. Energy ball. Oh, look at the water. Would, would lava still be hot? It wouldn't, right? I mean, I guess that's why we haven't seen any. But, you know, just as... Just, just thinking aloud. Just to be extra sure we don't have any statuses on us. More rocks. Uh... Which we will now put to use. Yay. Nice. Love the default attack still works on uh Shit. Uh default attack still works on ghost types. Delicious. Like the only reason that synthesis would be better was if for like when you're just exploring and you're poisoned but every other time and there's still Pokemon around that you can suck all the life out of oh that's a multi hit okay you're getting bit oh you're still awake interesting I wonder if after is still going to be so like optimistic in his talks now. Yeah, okay. They did such a good job hyping up Grovile, like make him look. And he was always a really like freaking competent dude. He was never bad. Like, I mean, he might be a bad guy, but that does not mean he is a bad guy. Uh, but he was always, like, really good at his job. Man, I sure do love that these are all ghost and dry, uh, psychic types. That's making me having bite a lot better. SPW never punished on <laughs> what, what his starter Pokemon is, even though he has no idea what these games hold. Don't worry, you'll get there one day, Quincy. Hey, see, you got it. You hit you hit as many shots as you needed. Uh, that's not good. Uh, hey, wake up. Hey, hey. Hey, wake up, he's gonna kick your ass. All right. You got this, I'm gonna throw rocks. Careful, boy. Got there. Good. Don't have to hit him. Thank you, Quincy. With this, like, frozen time stuff, it's like... Uh, oh, God. Oh, God, he's getting closer. 
uh, on the moon, there the idea is that there's still footprints from the first moonwalk because there is because like there's nothing to like erode the the, the footprints. That sucks. Bye. All right. <laughs> Deny me my XP, why don't you? Hello. Delicious. Might as well get some more use out of these. Uh, I don't think a normal attack will do it. Wait, wait, wait. You got this, Quincy. I might as well get rid of all these rocks. They're not doing much for me anymore. Almost got him. Oh, Lord, he coming. Uh, step. Quincy, I need you to not hit me right now. All right, cool. Petrus card. Oh, bye. Escape orb. Why don't I? No, he's gonna sucker punch me. I love that little bit of stank they've got it. Boink, 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 boink. I should probably. Why did I pick this up, man? Heal seeds also nice. We don't need those. Delicious. We have so many apples now. I feel slightly more like I feel like I should save the food more, even though that's dive. I mean, it just feels weird leaving it behind, you know? Like, I don't need to hold more food, but something about the setting is just like, there might be less food now. But from a mechanic standpoint, I don't think they'd do that. Why did I do that? Don't stat don't stat up, thank you. <laughs> oh, they didn't see it coming. This way. Before he catches us, is he a ghost type? Can he, I mean, he's a ghost type. Can he walk through walls though? I don't. I don't. I've never seen him. He can't. He's not cutting corners. Weird. Cannot all ghost type Pokemon fly through walls?
Wow. Hey, at least they're fast. <sighs> We've been climbing a long time now. Oh. This is like whenever you see these like long shots like this, it's usually they start to get like introspective. There was this one scene from Blue where uh that's when they first when the protagonist first sees Gardevoir. Uh that that's it's giving me that vibe. Like when we're traveling with uh Absol. Wow. Look at that after. Whoa. It was true. Future really is a world of darkness. A cluster of lights. It's beautiful, but those lights isn't that the stockade? Wow, we have climbed a long way. Hey, after. The great dust noir saved us more than once. He taught us many things too. That's a good point. He Why did he save us? Did he must have wanted our help with Grovile, and then after that was done, he offed us. He was gonna off us. That's why I, I came to really respect Dustmoor. But was Dustmoor deceiving us? After all this, I still can't believe it. I don't know what to believe anymore. I'm feeling all jumbled up. Quincy, what should we, what should we do now? How far do we have to run? How do we get back to our own world? Everyone at the guild. I wonder how they're doing. Are they worried about us? Wiggly Tough chats out Bidoof, everyone else. I wonder if they're doing well. I like that Bidoof's like the one that gets like top billing in the in the guild importance. I miss the guild. I want to see everyone. Quincy's feeling pretty down. It's only natural. What's happened so far? It's all so hard to believe. I'm scared too. But I can't give up now. If we don't keep going, those Sable I'll catch us. I've got to do something to cheer up Quincy. Words of support will seem like false comfort right now. If there was something I could say. Something that offers a glimmer of hope. If only there was some hope. We could get but we could work towards it. It could be anything. I just need to think of something. Hmm? What is it, after? Yeah, I think that's the right way to go. What? You wanted to go after Grovile? Why? You want to know something. Or asking something. But both are kind of the same thing. You want to know something? Oh, I see. Grovile went to our world from here the first time. So Grovile should know how to travel to our world. But isn't Grovile a bad Pokemon? Didn't he come to our world to steal the time gears? That's one thing I'm wondering. If Grovile steals the time gears... Time stops. I guess time was already still stopped in the future, so it's not changing anything. It just kind of, you know, there's just a lot of tech, like the the tech tree in the Civ game is further back because time stopped earlier. And the end result's the same. Time stopped, but now he's got the time gears. So I guess uh, just from, because looking at it from the base standpoint, if you steal the time gears from one spot, time still stops. I don't know. But I, I, I think I get his plan. How could I trust anything he would say? What about you, Aptor? Do you trust Grovile? I mean, we do have to trust him. I mean, I also don't know, but we should do that. Well, I can't trust him. A Pokemon like that? Never. There's no way I can trust him. There's just no way. But... But... I understand, Aptor. I don't know why, but Dustnor wants to get rid of us. That means the only Pokemon we know here in the future... That leaves only Grovile. We have no choice. We must pin our hopes on Grovile. Well then, okay. Okay, Aptor. Let's track down Grovile. Let's meet with Grovile and ask him how we can turn to our world. Quincy! Let's go, Aptor. Let's go after Grovile. Aptor, thank you. You tried to pick me up because I was feeling down. Even though you should be just as scared as I am after. I'm sorry. Even though I have my closest and most precious friend with me, I worried all alone. I almost gave up alone. When in fact, I'm not alone. I won't give up anymore. Because you're by my side. I can be brave after. I'm going to be fine now. So let's keep going. Let's go back to our world together. Yeah. 
don't send me into another dungeon. Thank you. I just wanted to save Rock. Time traveling is confusing in most scenarios. It's true. Since Grovile left, it's been one straight shot without any branching paths. So Grovile should be ahead of us on the same path. Let's go after. Uh, we will do that next week. <laughs> Damn, the game is... I mean, the, the, not that the game was ever even close to bad, but the game is getting juicy now. Everyone, thank you for watching. We're going to be doing this more next Wednesday. Uh, and tune in on Saturday. Do run in my run in some some of my D and D peeps through a D and D idea that I came up with. Uh, so stick around for that on Saturday. That's gonna be. I need to tweet about it. It's at 3 p.m. on Saturday. Uh, everyone, have a good night. I will see you later. Goodbye.